What is going on everybody? This is Strydogs here bringing you a brand new Castle Clash video. Oh my god, this video is probably the, mo the most exciting video, one of the most exciting videos I got to upload simply because of the new Castle Clash update. Oh my god, I'm sure a majority of y'all already know, know about it. Um, it came out today or earlier this morning, I should say, on September 28th. And um, I think it's Castle Clash 1.2.78 uh, update, I think it is. And pretty much what they did, guys, they added Hero Evolution, the new look to the game. Just There's all kinds of stuff I'm, I'm, we're about to get into that I'm going to talk about. So, let's go ahead and get started. First of all, guys, this is Castle Clash's new menu looking main screen okay so this is going to pop up and whatnot now look at it you got to pause the video if you need to pause it pause it but they updated the whole um startup of it it's looked totally different and whatnot so that's that's pretty cool and uh <clears throat> anyways let's um go ahead and get into this uh so pretty much guys i'm gonna have to bring i'm gonna bring this up right here so y'all can see this for a second um it may be kind of hard to see and whatnot, but this is everything that they added, okay? So first, uh, let's see if I had the 1.275, that's what it is, not 78, 75. So anyways, guys, they added a new hero evolution, okay? Excluding the Dread Drake and Skull Knight. Obviously, I'm, um, I'm sure y'all can, can read and whatnot, but you know, I'm just going to read the majority of it for the most part. Okay, um, so <clears throat> this is what they added for the, the new update. Players can now sp uh, speed up their upgrades. I guess if you're new... Um, your constructions that take less than five minutes, you can just speed up instantly. So that's pretty cool. They added new XP and hero skill XP boosting item. Bless Tomb One grants a hundred thousand XP. Uh, Bless Tomb Two, five hundred thousand uh, mastery essence. One grants fifteen thousand XP. So the, like the whole five hundred thousand, oh, that's that's a lot. So that's that's awesome. They added a new dungeon suite feature, which is also you can auto clear dungeons. Instead of just having to watch the whole dungeon, you can just go into the dungeon and just click auto sweep, and it'll just run through the dungeon one time instantly without even going, without even running through it. Um, I will show y'all everything in just a second how it works. Um, they also added a help button here, added a uh, second confirmation problem with upgrading talents, uh, like our. It'll say that you'll upgrade it. Are you sure you want to upgrade it? Then you'll hit, hit OK. Are you double sure you want to upgrade it type of thing? So that's that. Uh, they added new rewards. So 350,000 gems. You know, Spirit Mage, so on and so forth. This is from getting the gems. This is all you can get right here. Um, the new hero, Dread Drake, which is the pirate. Some of y'all may have seen. Um, here's his description and stuff right here. If y'all want to pause the video, you can read that as well. Um, I'm gonna. Try, I'm just gonna try to just roll, scroll it through this pretty quick. If y'all want to pause it, y'all can go ahead and pause it. Um, increase the gold and mana rewards from clearing stages in Insane Dungeon Four. Okay, that's pretty cool. Updated the appearance of high level buildings. That's another one that's awesome because when you get to the high level buildings, you're upgrading uh, all your buildings or whatever. Um, instead of having the same look to them, they look even more. You know, more cooler or whatever. You, I, whatever word you should use for that, but you know, that's awesome. Um, instead of having to be able to hold 1 million uh, honor badges, you can now hold 5 million, which is awesome. Um, attributes such as levels, talents, crests, etc. of heroes deployed for defense in the arena will no longer update automatically. Um, let's see, players cannot go to empty tabs and the hero altar and warehouse. Don't really know what that means, but okay. Increase some of the daily rewards, that's awesome. Reduce price in tombs, okay, that's cool. Uh, for the newer guys, this is the might required for to do some of the things right here. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so that's pretty much that, guys. So now, let's go ahead and get into the game, and I can show y'all what everything freaking looks like. Oh, my God. Let's get in. Oh, gosh. Look, I don't want to know what I'm doing right now, but let's get to this. Hero Evolution is the first thing I want to talk about. Guys, whenever you evolve your heroes, so for instance, okay, this is your regular hero. Okay, it's just a regular Vlad, you know, no big deal or whatever. Obviously, I do not have him updated. Okay, he's not evolved or nothing like that. Let me show you what a evolved. We well, you know what? 
hold on. For those who don't know, I'm going to go back to this for a second. Um, let me see if I can find something right quick. So guys, those of y'all who don't know, this is what a regular destroyer looks like. Okay, this is destroyer. That's what a destroyer looks like on Castle Clash. It is my favorite hero. So that's just a regular destroyer. Now let's take a look at an evolved destroyer. Okay, an evolved destroyer looks something like, hold on, like, like this guy right here. Okay. What? Just wait till he just comes across the screen. Look at him! Oh my God! Like what, dude? He looks freaking awesome, guys. This is an evolved destroyer. So here he is, right here. He's level 140. Um, so pretty much how this works. Okay, obviously you're gonna see my other evolved hero here, my Moltanica. Okay, so I have two evolved heroes. So pretty much I'm gonna go ahead and explain how this works. You have a level, before he was evolved, he was level 180, okay? So, let's take Pumpkin Duke, for instance. Once you hit level 180, level 10, okay, you can now evolve your heroes. See, for instance, I can't evolve Ares because he's not level 180, okay? So, once he hits level 180, you can evolve. And in order to evolve Pumpkin Duke, you're going to need an Essent, or whatever this is called right here, which you can purchase it right here. These uh, an evolution room is what it is what it's called. One thousand uh, fame. Yeah, one thousand fame. You need to uh to buy this. Okay, so um, where was I? Hold on. Let me go back to my hero altar. So if I want to evolve him, it takes one thousand fame or one one of the fame uh, one rune or one uh essence or whatever which is 1000 fame 1000 red crystals and a well I'm pretty sure it's either 20,000 shards I don't know why it says 20,000 or 1000 or 72 but anyways you can use a pumpkin duke card you don't even have to use shards so you just ha only need one pumpkin duke card once you have that and uh it brings him automatically the four stars okay so instead of you don't need honor badges or nothing. Once you get the, uh, once you evolve him, he from level one. I'm pretty sure you can level him. Let's see, 20, 40, 60. You can level him all. You can level him all the way up to, up to level 80 without using any honor badges. Okay, so that's what that does right here. And these stats right here will transfer over to your new pumpkin duke. You don't lose. You don't lose your talent, so your, your your ability up here, 9 out of 10, all that stays the same. They're just, your stats are increased, okay? Right here, see where uh, my mouse is over? All this is just increased more. So, a level 1, level 1, uh, what is it? Where's my, hold on, let me show you my destroyer. My destroyer at level 1, okay, was stronger than a, my destroyer at level 180, regular, okay? So, an evolved destroyer is stronger at level 1 than a regular destroyer at level 180 and that is that that is the same for every hero that you have so in evolving your hero is will make your hero stronger than its original level okay if that makes any sense and uh your talents and everything will roll over onto that new hero so that's that's that and uh see here's my Multanica right here um, I'm in the process of leveling him up to 9 of 10 right now he should have been the first one but I just went ahead and got my Vlad to 9 of 10 as well but uh so yeah that's that guys so that's hero evolving which is freaking awesome um, here's what they look like right here They have that little golden glow below them your regular legendaries have the little purple glow below them so that is that is awesome you can also see here your uh, your hero base looks a little cooler too. It looks a lot different than the than the normal look, as well as the gold ball. Like all all your all your buildings, like your town hall level twenty five right here, upgraded. It looks a lot different. Um, what else looks different? What else looks different? I know your uh, army camps will look different at level twenty five. Um, because I've seen I've seen some of those. Uh, so I guess that's that's that. If y'all want to see some other heroes, I guess I can show y'all. This might be a little longer video than y'all what y'all expected, but that it will be okay. Gotta start the boss battle for everybody. Hold on a second. 
That was my fault. Oh, Y'all gotta get all kinds of stuff in this video, huh? Let's see here. Um... Here, hold on, let me go ahead and do this boss just for one second, guys. <laughs> I know I'm jumping, jumping to uh, all kinds of other different stuff, but I'm doing boss through real quick. It shouldn't take very long. I'm gonna get him to like 30. I'm gonna take off about 30 million health real quick, just to uh, get some honor badges. Cause now honor badges, I need them. Before I didn't really need them, you know. So gotta go ahead and take off some damage right quick, guys. This may be a little bit more lengthier video than normal, but it is okay because this video is worth putting up for everyone to be watching, you know, so. So he should be about pretty close. It took about 30 seconds, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, end it right there, see where he's at. 30 million, which is perfect. Okay, so they can do what they need to do with that. Now, let's go to the dungeons, guys. Oh, let me put him back. Okay, let's go to the dungeons. So now they added a new feature as far as the... Dungeon sweeps. I'm just gonna do these for instance right here. You can sweep for three thousand dollars, three thousand coins. Okay, not three thousand dollars, three thousand coins. So what you do? You hit sweep, and then you beat the dungeon. You hit sweep again. You beat the dungeon. You just do it all, as many as you want. You sweep. Obviously, the lower the dungeon, the, lo the less it costs. Um, I'm pretty sure you can sweep these two. No, you cannot yet. Let's see. You probably have to beat it first before you can sweep. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Let me see, because I beat these. Okay, you got to three-star it in order to sweep it, apparently. Three and two, one and two-star does not count. So, yeah, that's that. You can sweep dungeons here, and that'll be, that's awesome for, uh, you don't have to waste much time, you know. Um, let, as you can see, I'm not getting very lucky with my shards here. So, I have, I've already swept, and I have, I've gotten shards by doing that as well. Not really sure if that affects it at all, but, uh. But yeah, that's that. Let's see what else they could have added. I know they added things like this. Blessed Tomb, which is 100,000 XP. Okay, and they also added the Blessed yeah, blessed 1 and Blessed 2. 500,000 here. So if I want to take my Ares from 173, all I got to do is just to, to 180 is add the books. And he's already level 180 from level 173. Oh my god, it's freaking crazy. Wow. But uh, I'm not going to do that, so... Um, I'm saving those because I want to level my my uh, destroyer up. And uh, yes, from what I have heard, guys, there is a. Oh, I'm all hit level 140. That's cool. But um, there is a second evolution. So once you're you're a basic destroyer, you're ev you evolve one time. Okay, you go all the way to 180. Then rumors I'm hearing is you can go to once you hit 180, you can evolve again, okay, for a second time to make a hero that much more stronger. And he might even look different as well, so I don't, I don't want to know. It's like so much stuff is going on, it's crazy. Um, but for the most part, guys, I think if... That should be it, if I... Not mistaking everybody. Um... Just making sure I'm not missing anything here. Let me go back and look at the update on the website. Uh, let's see. Blah, blah, blah. You have more honor badges. You can get hold up to 5 million now. Um, that should be it, everybody, honestly. Uh, but, yeah, as far as that, I love the new look. The golden dragon. The fire-looking golden dragon. And the destroyer as well. It is freaking awesome. Like, they did a great job with this update. Let's see, like the buildings, for instance. Here, I know I've seen it somewhere. Let's see. Your uh, your army camps. Where did I see it at? Somebody had it. And I can't seem to, to find it. But they had a... Is this it? Yeah, this is it right here. Here it is, guys. Here's a army camp upgraded all the way with a new update. That's that. Same with the mines right here. See the looks to it, guys? It looks totally different. Same with the to the towers. I mean, I think it looks awesome. Like, just the way they updated everything. It's just... Here's the... Even, even the magic in the altar. Look at it. They just made everything look awesome. But, uh... 
Uh, that's going to do it for the update, everybody. Um, I guess, I don't know if, what, if I want to show y'all anything else, if we have anything else. Let me see. I feel like I just want to keep showing y'all everything because this is freaking awesome. Obviously, Vlad here, has, he doesn't look any different. Uh, Pumpkin Duke here doesn't look any different. They just look the same, even though they're upgraded, even though they're evolved. I know Druid. Where is my, where is a Druid? There is a Druid somewhere. Who has a Druid? Is it George? Hey, there we go. Look at Druid, guys. Druid upgrade evolved. He looks freaking awesome as well. I don't know if he'll turn around or not. Let's give him about five seconds here. Turn around, Druid. There he is. Kind of hard to see, but he looks he looks awesome as well. He's he's a lot bigger and whatnot. Looks freaking tough. So, but yeah, that's that. Okay, guys, that's good for today's video. I can talk for on and on about all this. But I hope you all enjoyed the video. If I did, leave a like, comment, subscribe, whatever it may be. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. There will be plenty more of these videos coming out. And yeah, until next time, guys, <clears throat> this is Strydox. And I will see y'all later. Peace.